Tonight, Governor Mike DeWine has ordered all flags in Ohio to fly at half staff today to honor Cleveland firefighter Johnny Tetrick, who was killed in a hit and run on I-90 East. Tetrick was responding to a previous crash near MLK Drive last night when he was struck by the car that sped off. A search overnight for the driver led to the arrest of a suspect this morning. Lydia Spara joins us now live from Cleveland Fire Station 22, where Tetrick worked with more on how his friends are remembering him and his service to our community. Lydia, good evening. And good evening to you, Lena. They are with heavy hearts here all around the city of Cleveland. And yes, we are at Station 22. This is where Tetrick had worked at this station for 23 years. Take a look. You can see that the flag is now at half staff to honor, of course, one of their fallen heroes. As you said, Lena, Station 22 did respond to a call on eastbound at MLK. Officials would later confirm Johnny Tetrick was hit by a car. Tetrick was at station 22 as we mentioned he was transported to uh where he was pronounced dead now i spoke to former fire chief angelo cavillo he worked with tetrick as a firefighter and says johnny was a good man soft-spoken but yet strong you know and you can know you can depend on johnny and uh, he was just a great fireman a great person and a tremendous loss to the city of cleveland division of fire uh, just a tremendous loss Indeed, a tremendous loss here for the city of Cleveland for Fire Station 22. There has not been a firefighter who's died in the line of duty for nearly 35 years. And Cavillo says his funeral will be unprecedented like nothing you've ever seen before. We'll have more on that, Lena, coming up tonight on What's Next. Oh, my goodness, so heartbreaking. Thank you so much, Lydia. It we'll is. see you at 11.